all right guys we are back we are <coughs> dying okay no seriously we are back we are on windows as you can see it looks a little bit different we are traveling we are in germany um therefore we are on our laptop right now because we have to leave the setup at home therefore we are back on windows boo yeah, i know some of you guys are celebrating but no seriously um let's uh this again what are we doing we're covering pancake swap updated you know 2022 uh, from the last video you guys got a little bit lucky because if you weren't following along from the other video this video is your perfect chance to get back in because i will have to be reinstalling a lot of the base apps um from my setup on this uh windows laptop here because um, we're on a different computer so installing node.js the whole thing so if you have no idea what you're doing you can go watch the first video but this also is a perfect video because we'll be installing everything from scratch and starting um not really all over i won't be um, explaining the first bit uh, in so much detail but i'll be going over it real quickly so it's a perfect chance for you guys to get back in and again guys quick reminder if you want something like this or any other web project done email down below reach out to me and my team will get it done for you we have a list of specialist blockchain developers as well as specialist um react and web 3 web 2 developers including me and more myself okay um so yeah quickly let's just get into it the first thing i want to do here um you know like i kind of just want to like reinstall node.js because i know i don't have it you can see i was typing it here real quick I'm just gonna go install node.js real quick um as well as get the pancake swap files because I know uh, we don't have them um, on this setup. I have my hard drive here, but I figure it's just worth it to just go again from scratch. Um, let's get the installer. Hopefully everything downloads quick and we have a fast Wi-Fi connection. If you do hear rattling or noise, that is my dog trying to get at my cat. And so, yeah, I mean, if if in case of emergency, um, hit pause. Okay. Um, but, yeah, uh, so that's Node.js. Just get this real quick. So guys, you basically, you know, this is standard inst Windows stuff. You just go Node.js download, you hit the installer um, for yourself, Linux, blah, 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 Windows. I got the Windows installer. You click accept everything, you know, you set out your whole privacy. And so I just hit accept everything. I'm just kidding. Um, hello, install necessary tools, blah, blah, blah. I'm gonna click yes to that as well um you know just click yes and hope everything goes smoothly so we can have our node.js set up um and we're gonna need this to like um develop our pancakes up uh uh from from the github all right so that's one boom Continue, continue. This thing could be asking me to like if I'm do you agree to sell your soul to like Node.js Corp? And I'd be like, yes, continue. <laughs> <Just see. clears throat> okay, and if you have this part, if you have Node.js already installed, you can just go ahead and skip this part of the video. Um skip to where we have I'm downloading the pancake sub files if you haven't followed from last video. And then, um, because really what we want to be doing <clears throat> this video is we want to kind of just, uh, I'm very curious about what the changes that the pancakes are made from the last time I was, I was doing it. Um, the Python is not installed, so we have to get that real quick. Oh no, it's doing it for us. Super nice. Um, so I kind of just, I also want to look through the files. I also want to get uh, some of our edits done because we're trying to build this time around. Last time we built um, just the essentials, which maybe that's what we'll do again with the update, you know. Um, but I think the Pancake Swap, the Pancake Swap team, um, I shout out the Pancake Swap team, um, I did a lot more stuff. Um, Pancake Swap is like one of the very few applications on Web3, I'd say, that are like actually value added to the community. So I have to show them always um so and by uh binance smart chain but yeah i mean uh what was i saying the um 
we're going to be going through like the fast kind of just see what like technology changed in in like what they were doing obviously to just set it up but i'm always curious about what technology they're using um uh, or is being used in front-end development um which there's a lot of that um in the pancake swap github so we'll kind of just be looking through there as well as seeing what we can get set up um, I think I'll start, um, you guys are coming along with me as I'm doing this whole thing from scratch. So I think I'll kind of just start um, trying to replicate first the features that like were on the base, the original. So that's the swap, the token, the farms, um, you know, with the updated UI and then we'll take it from there with anything else that we want added. Um, so again, good video to get. To jump into it because we're literally starting from scratch here on my computer you guys know i don't do edits i will try my best to do um timestamps but yeah um blah 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 blah, blah. plus no backup has been created before blah blah, blah. all right i think that's okay oh i think we should have our node.js working let me just uh, check that real quick powershell All right, it's good. You can also check. You can also do node v, node v. Can I see what um uh, version you have? As well as npm. Can I just see um that both are installed? So I'm on sixteen point eighteen point zero, which I guess is the latest stable version. Now we head on over to Pancake Swap GitHub. I hope they haven't really released a major release since the last video um, or else we'll just be splitting this video into part one and part two but um, chances are we'll be okay um, so we're gonna go I'm not gonna do the develop I'm gonna do um, master and again guys can I just take note of what commits I'm doing what how I navigate this here because you guys can run into a lot of Problem, problems if you try to um, build the wrong version. All right, one point seven megabytes a second. Not bad, not terrible. Um, considering we're not at home. Um, yeah. All right. Next thing, while we're waiting for this to download, let's just check crypto markets real quick. No, we always gotta do that. Always gotta do that. Last time I saw Bitcoin was at nineteen two. I last night I'm not. I'm. I'm g guessing. Okay, like this story. You know. Um, last night it was at nineteen. Looked like it was trading down. There's no volatility. My guess is it's gonna be flipping between nineteen and nineteen five. So let's say last night was trading down. It was a bottom range. I'm gonna guess it's a top of range this time. We're guessing nineteen three or nineteen two. Ah, you need to see it. It cracked the um nineteen low. Um, so it probably cracked the range here. So maybe a bigger dump earlier and then bounce back. If I know we kind of love, let me see the chart. You know, it's actually like a low low of the day. So not a lot of volatility here. If I had to make my guess, it's gonna end the day up um above nineteen five or something like that. Um, if you, if it's gonna crack nineteen, it's gonna have to crack it more um, dramatically than this um, to to really um, sink lower. By the way, guys, just putting it out, putting it out there. The flipping is happening. Okay, market cap being eaten away by Ethereum here. Now is the time. Long long Ethereum short Bitcoin. That's the spread trade. Just one day record I put out there. The flipping um twenty twenty two. All right, got it on camera. All right, so um, do we have our files downloaded? Yes, 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 yes. All right, let's get it extracted. Let me take a quick peek. Master. All right, good, good, good. So we're just gonna drag this here um, on our desktop so we can find it easily. Um, 
So I'm just gonna do here real quick, get a new folder to keep everything organized. Active, I'm gonna do mm, pancake. I'm just gonna drag this here. Um, So again, a uh, quick recap, you know, just make sure you have your tools, um, Node.js. I think I'm also going to need TypeScript, so I'm going to go ahead and get that now. Um, but get your Node.js, get your pancake swap files from the GitHub. Um, now we're going to get TypeScript. I think uh, pancake swap is in TypeScript. <laughs> You know how when you go to like a new J a new to install new it's just like ah install and it's like I know how to, this is what I'm looking for. They should make this easier to find. Like you go on Node.js packages, it's usually just, um, it's the first thing that's here. You just copy paste, you move on with your life. But TypeScript team, I hope you're watching this. So that's npm install g TypeScript and this will install TypeScript globally with Node.js so that we can compile our files. So you're gonna need to do all this, um, before we get to um, developing anything um, on our um, pancake swap. And of course, um, you're gonna need your code editor. I use Atom, but you can use whatever you want, including Notepad, but I would not recommend it. Okay. Um, a quick check here, just to make sure everything is good here. Uh, show me the time. All right, it seems like we're good. Still waiting for this to go. So, so as I, my dog is giving a hell of a time. Shout out, Sarah. Um, let me just close a little bit here to see if we can save on some processing power. Maybe we go a little bit faster. A little bit. Probably gonna pause and split this uh, once I get it all set because, like I said, we're basically starting from scratch. So this could very well be a part one, just like before. I'll continue the I'll continue the video just to see him. But sometimes, you know, technical difficulties arise. So if there is a pause in the video, um, all right, guys, this was, um, you know, um, a continuation of what we're doing, which is cloning pancake swap. And again, quick reminder, if you want this or any other web project, web two, web three project done, email down below. Me and my guys will get it done for you. We have a team of professional expert developers to get all your development needs met always gotta chill boys always gotta chill all right um just waiting for this to be finished oh this is sarah causing a bit of a racket there it's okay sarah it's okay relax relax until i calm her down just trying to get at my cat food you know She's not introduced yet um, uh, to her cat Jenny, you know, so she's a bit curious.
It's okay, Jenny, Jenny. It's okay. You wanna, wanna sit here? Over here, Jenny's not used to any form of activity, really. So let's just see if she'll allow me to pick her up and show her on camera. Hey, Jenny, Jenny. Ah, I gotta be careful, with Jenny. Here, say hi, Jenny. Hey, Good girl. Now she wants to stay in her lap. Ah, Jenny's such a nice cat. But um, Jenny, we're making pancakes up. Don't you know what's going on? Um, still waiting for the copy. She's trying to finish, trying to finish me for food. Mm. Jenny, why can't Sarah be as well behaved as you? Okay. Shout out to all my cats and dogs, people. Write in the comments down below who is a cat person, who is a dog person. Okay. Write down below, and if anybody guesses if I'm a cat, <laughs> Jenny, you need to lick yourself better. All right. Who guesses if I'm a cat person or a dog person will win a prize, okay? They'll win a free uh, copy of the course once it's um, once it's fully out. Um, in more information down below about the course, obviously, um, as well as the email for contact. But um, Jenny, we continue. Um, you know, it's still possible. Okay, so, Jenny, Jenny, bye-bye. Okay? Ah, there you go, there you go. Uh, Jenny with the claws, man. All right, so we um, all right, we have finished copying. Perfecto. So let's see if now we can install and get it up in running. I'm gonna do yarn install. Ah, we don't have yarn, do we? That's what I thought. So we're gonna get that real quick as well. Uh, yarn download. <sighs> All right, beautiful. Let's try that again. So again, if you maybe skipping over, so you know, if you want to get this um this thing here open, PowerShell here, this this window, you have to hold down the shift and click right click, and you'll be able to see like open PowerShell, right? And then I just yarn install. Yeah. Can I be a little bit because running scripts is disabled on this computer. All right, so if you get this error, I've seen this before. This is like a Windows error. Um, say you need to enable scripts to be run, blah, blah, blah. I'm just gonna like, gonna um, copy this real quick. I remember there's a command you need to put, um, but so I'll just get, get this here real quick. Um, power says execution of scripts disabled, blah, blah, blah. We're gonna have to, um, turn this on in Windows, which is it. Oh, when you're done, you can't see the policy. But, all right, so I'm just going to like set execution policy remote signed. All right, that should allow us to do what we want. All right, then I do A is to all. Blah, blah, permission denied. All right, so this is probably gonna want me to run it as administrator for me to do that. So I'm gonna go PowerShell again. This time I'm gonna do run as administrator. All right, uh, it's, so I'm gonna do this command again, which I can get just by hitting the up key. I'm gonna do yes to all, it got no problems there. Um, we should be good for that. We open PowerShell again. Uh, in our folder, so again, let's go to navigate the folder. Hold on, right click, then PowerShell here, and we do yarn install once more. We should be good to go this time. And this could take a minute, you know. 
locally our internet is not too slow but once this is done we should have our own version of uh, the pancake swap UI running from our computer which means we can make whatever changes we want to the front end add our own images or own text or own logos um, yeah so it's the beginning of the beginning of the beginning and then we're gonna go past the beginning of the beginning of the beginning to like do some some nerd shit <laughs> okay um, I would be looking up jokes like memes on like Twitter like you know, crypto price memes, different stuff like this. But honestly, I haven't used this computer in a while, so I don't want you all to see my porn. As well as I'm kidding. No, but the um, I as I um, I don't want this computer to crash because I don't know like how well it's handling. It seems to be handling pretty well, which is actually quite surprising because my uh my build desktop. I guess I need a graphics card for that. My graphics card got botched. I put in a shitty graphics card in there. And so, but this small PC seems like it's being even faster than that, which is running a six core AMD, um, uh, Gen 6, I think I don't remember. AMD, what's its name again? Uh, Ryzen 6 or something like that. So, um, and this is like very, very slow Intel, almost Intel, not quite Intel Atom, but um like almost dual core like early 2000 dual core, core type things it has a fast enough hard drive but you know on a decent ish graphics card but and it seems to maybe even be running better than that so i really need to get a graphics card um for my computer maybe i will get one now that i am in leonberg germany and we do have access to this very very slick amazon fast shipping because it sucks in jamaica but uh, which is where I'm from. So if you guys didn't know what all the locks was a locks were about, that's what it's about. It's from, I'm from Jamaica. Um, yeah, but um, yeah, me and, and me and the team are international, of course. So no, stop crashing, you. Do not crash. Ah, could not find git binary, bitch. All right, tell you, this is the deal. Okay, continue just along. Install all your things. Don't screw me and I'll download Git, I promise. Okay. He wants me to download um, GitHub. Uh, I'm just gonna get it real quick. I don't know what it, why it's stalling. It should have exited or finished. So I'm just gonna download, go git download uh, for windows this is how you know how like fresh this setup is guys like don't even have git what kind of developer are you man how could you not have git Oh, speeds are killing us. Okay. All right, me know what that is um, sucking our life away. Let me see if I can. Get it from another link that is faster, maybe. Figure. Oh. Oh my, that's that's nice. Um, no, no. I think this first one picked up. I bet you the minute I hit X, it will fall like a rock. Try. 
really weird. Don't know why it was. Let me try this again. I know what it's like doing it multiple times. I'm just curious why I was moving faster when there was only like 10 of them. Maybe something with like the op amount of open connections. Alright, never mind this. It's quite odd. Hey, let me try a little trick. Alright, so I'm just gonna X this because. Alright, and possibly that was causing us to move still. Maybe it was doing something. No, guys, a lot of prompts, a lot of, um, stuff yeah, I'm just gonna click next to everything um do I have no factors plus if I did I would use it. I would use it. Right, so for now, I'm going to use nano because I know nano. You can click, you can just click right through this to be honest. I just uh, I know what I'm doing, so I maybe want some of this option, but Rick, honestly, uh, you know, just click, click yes to everything, click yes, sell your soul, everything. Uh, so hopefully once this is installed or, or yarn installer will we'll go pretty quick. Honestly, we're going to do this video in like two parts. I think we don't want this to be super, super long, uh, considering that we already covered this part. So maybe like part 1.1, you know, with Windows, you know, um, shout out my Ubuntu people, you got your chance. Um, all right, so release notes finished. Da, 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 da. We don't want to see release notes. We just want to be going. All right, so. I'm going to have to relaunch this, I believe. So I'm going to open this again so I can recognize the kids. And yarn install once more. Hope we go quick, quick, quick. Mm 
Meanwhile, we are waiting for this to download. Let me see if I can open Binance and lose some money trading. Um, you heard, you heard, you guys heard the call earlier. I'm like, I wanna bet that this thing is gonna like set level 19. So, ballsy bet. So if I do, um, take a trade. You know how it went to look, look at the date. I know we're, we're chopping the, the 19 range. Let me look real quick. So we are cracking 18 lows. We did 18 eights last night or yesterday looks like uh, yesterday or the day before okay we're cracking 18 9 okay 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 um, making lows of the day um, what time is it I want to know what time is it in the US it's 4 so in five hours, four or five hours, US opens. Um, so four hours ago was like 12. So, so it's been pretty chopping a range. <laughs> well, guys, while we're waiting for this to install, I will come up with my great big brain thesis of where Bitcoin price will be in a few hours. And it's the installing all these packages should be every day in and of itself. Mm. So setup, there isn't much of like a setup here, I think, you know, I think it's just like, obviously you could argue it's going back to the 19 ish yeah. Come on guys, like we, we don't have a lot to do when we're waiting here, so might as well. Um, obviously there is not like a ton of volatility here. Um, 18 19 support looking weak 18 not 18 not looking strong i don't see like a i don't see a great trade here to be honest you know for i can see going both ways i can see both returning to 19 but not going much further as well as i can see it you know um like like staying right here without going much lower you know, so probably 19 is the CF bit. Um, yeah, and we have movement. Okay. How much movement? Installing. Oh, God. We've gone to more installing. I should have known. Um, relax, Sarah. Relax. It's okay. Sarah, I did again. The fiend of this story. Oh, okay. A little bit of a move down here on the 18 to 189. Let's see how well 189 holds. Seems like it's holding pretty well. Um, oh, what type of a move was that? Okay, so it's falling, you know. My money's still. Let's see if, if 189 holds super well. Um, then I bet my money and return, I returned to 19, which it seems like it's doing. That was a bit of a sell off there. Um, just, you know, so we're all on the same page here. We're looking at this candle. Okay, this nice one minute fall there. Um, All right, so 89 held pretty, pretty decent. I'd watch it over the course of the next five, 10 minutes, to see just so well, but we have to be careful that, we have to be mindful that we're on low, low volume 
falling pretty well. So that tells me where the trend generally is. Um, you can't make a big, you can't make a great assessment of low volume like that, but it's pretty decent volume on the overlay, I suppose. Um, price looks weak to me. I don't know what to say. We could, I, I can see us dropping, uh, I can see us dropping pretty. Uh, price looks weak, but at the same time, I'm confident that because of like the low um, volume here, like certain trading ranges are going to hold. So, I mean, if I was a betting man, and I am, okay, I'd maybe like, I'd maybe bet that this doesn't fall below 18.8 with a looking for a push up back to 19.2, 19.3, there about, you know. Um, what type of risk reward is that? I don't even know. Let us look. So we're looking at two twists, about 2.5 risk reward. Um, I'm not sure it like that. Hey, Jenny, Jenny. Hey, Jenny, Jenny. Jenny, Jenny wants to return to us, guys. You wanna come? Do you? Do you? Yes. <sighs> She's, you know, she wants to come, I guess, but she's shy. She either is shy or she wants food. Honestly, probably the latter. Um, ah, no, we jump up. It's okay. It's okay. I think she really just wants food. She keeps trying to like call money. She's like, no, that's she in my mind. It's okay. I think she maybe just wants me to rub her head. Rub her head. Yeah. You guys hear that? What about Jenny? Jenny, Jenny from the block. While we wait on our yarn. Um, box. If you guys are wondering why I don't edit these videos, honestly, I don't have the skill. <laughs> or the patience. Yay, it's darling. Sure, it would have been going okay. It would have been going fairly okay so far, right? Like, if I had taken it there, which I would have, it would have been going okay so far. We didn't because we don't want to get too distracted here, but it's still there, you know, it's still, it's still a good trade. But we do not want to be the distracted. And honestly, when if it's not happening in the next four hours before US open, we might get shit on um at US open, so yeah. We'd have to watch US open very carefully, which means we'd probably be in the trade for like the next four hours 
five six hours if um if the trade doesn't um, go super well before you is open which because of low volume it probably wouldn't but we are trading down bitcoin is trading down it's the flipping in boys i'm telling you okay ethereum has to surpass bitcoin this cycle okay or maybe the next one but it's coming long ethereum sure bitcoin not on a fundamental not on like a prince um philosophical level on a fundamental level you know long live bitcoin <laughs> Hey Jenny, Jenny. And he's so happy when you remember it. It's so fun. As happy as I'll be when this is done, Jesus Christ. Jenny from the block. We're starting to see where that six core, or eight core AMD horizon was really coming in handy. I didn't realize how long this thing took. Jenny, are you sick and tired of waiting to I feel you? Luckily for our friends on YouTube, they can just hit fast forward and we have to put up with this bullshit, but they will have to put up with this bullshit if they don't um, hit up the email down below and um, have me and my boys take care of it for them.
Ah. Theta, not a Git repository or successful generate 126 typings. Husky install Theta, not a Git repository and a printer that I get. I don't know what the hell that means. We're just going to try Yarn Dev and hope that it works. And seems like maybe we will. So we should hit up local host. Praise boy, praise. We're hoping to see bunnies, pink bunnies, bro. Pink and brown bunnies, pancakes swap. Don't feel us. seriously guys and um what we should we be doing in the other videos honestly guys these videos are gonna come out in random order um i uh i want to do some other projects as well um web three projects as well as web two projects and cover them on the channel um you know i like doing these pancakes so videos, but obviously i get a little bit more hey, Jimmy, Jimmy, Jimmy. it's okay it's okay we'll be doing more pancakes so videos it's okay um but um yeah we want to cover some more stuff as well maybe some shopify stuff some wordpress stuff honestly um just change it up a little bit so we don't get too stuck in our ways compile client and blah 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 funk fuck okay compiling home sending to me She's like eating the plant. I'm sorry, I have to like. I hope you can see. She's just like, she's just like, yo, I'm just so hungry. I'm just gonna like be. This plant is like mine. Just over. <laughs> oh my god. Um, so funny. Such a greedy little cat. But um, her animal. Why are animals so greedy? But um, yeah, all right, come on, pancakes up, come on, bro. We've been waiting a long time. Come on, come on, don't do us like that. Waiting, waiting. Fail to create storage, falling back to noob storage. Um, guessing that is finally, finally, bro. Brown bunnies, pink and brown bunnies. Savior Almighty, thank you, thank you. We needed it. Okay, so just a little bit, some of the features that got added since I remember, I guess they had it added perpetual trading i don't know if we'll cover that in the tutorial we'll definitely be covering swaps but i don't know about your perpetual trading platform i think that's a whole different um side maybe even a different team covering that um but boys we do have pancake swap it was a long road but we finally have it running on our local host from all the toolings that we have to download so you guys know the node.js the typescript the waiting oh my the waiting um but finally, we are here and to demonstrate this, we're just going to, as is tradition, get rid of the jetpack bunny who always makes us lag a little bit. Okay, it's not making us lag so bad now because the graphics card is a little bit better, but jetpack bunny, you gotta go. Okay, um, let's open this up with Atom. And God, this video is way too long for the part one. You see how much like effort it takes to cut this video down, guys. You know, and go watch that video down below if you want to 
the, to the right if you want a quicker one and again emails down below if you don't want to put up with this as well as guys we'll probably be launching a course on how to really set up pancake swap of course um as well as other things but the point um you know i've gotten some emails about that and the answer is guys we're kind of just doing this course as we go so like you guys i have some videos in there that like make it really easy to like set it up um as well as you know covering some some basic questions but to be honest we're kind of just making up as it goes as you guys request the modules or they become like gaps in the training we'll just you know i'll just record when i'm through that in so right now it's probably the best time to get it you know get it um while it's in this beta beta phase because then you can uh request what module you want and it'll pretty make pretty much get thrown into the air but that won't last forever so again if you want that or to work with me and my team email down below um reach out to me and um we'll cover your questions jenny why you can tell me bro were you enjoying your plant okay um all right adam launched uh let's add folder you know we gotta add our pancake swap folder pancake front end select okay now if i remember this correctly it is source views home components hero i think um ah and i think this is our bunny image okay bye bye bunny actually i don't think that's gonna go bye bye because uh typescript doesn't recognize those as comments yeah, did it did it do something maybe it did something Oh no, it did do something, but we just did the wrong thing. Bye bye, Bonnie. Bonnie. Recompiling. Alright, so. Um, it, it, it did do something, it just this doesn't rec recognize this as. Um, as comments here so let me do if you don't know these are block style comments which i guess is what typescript recognizes compiling bonnie come on go away this is bonnie right see you Hero, bunny. I see is here. This is also, um, I always have my JSX to like for these comments. What am I doing? Like, let's just bye bye. We'll see. And we got rid of Bunny. Okay, it took a while, but at least now we're not lagging. Goddamn Bunny, show the pancake swap. All right. Um, but guys, this is kind of like where we did it in the part one. Again, I'll be continuing it almost immediately. Um, it even started to rain. This video is a little bit too long, so I'm going to chop it up a little bit. But that was part one. We visited the on Windows, fuller, uh, more full version with all the tools being added. You guys saw me do it from scratch, literally from scratch, because Jane scratched us when she was going down. She didn't do it on accident. It's okay. She did it on purpose. It's okay. She, she so easily started. Um, but yeah, guys, I will see you in the next one right there where we will cover part two of just going into what strategy we will be using um, uh, to, um, she's so sorry, um, what strategy we will be using to, um, for what features we're choosing. 
as well as um <laughs> as well as um uh what things we will be adding so we're just going to be going over what what things they added um what new things we'll be covering um up there or there um in the next one so i will see you guys right